Hi guys, this is like a talk funding update, um, day in the life of, shall we say, um, whatever. Um, it's been a crazy week this week and I have a monthly update video coming out hopefully this week or starting next week. Um, but really, I just wanted to share like the ethos of talk funding is really about helping people. I sincerely want to help people, companies win, I mean, reach their goals, not even reach goals, but surpass their goals. Because I know the highs and lows and um, hit storms, shall we say, I don't want to get uh, banned by YouTube by saying another word beginning with S and ending with IT. Um, so that you that the entrepreneurial journey can be. It's not an easy journey, folks, to bring a product to market. Um, people I've interviewed now nearly 50 uh, uh, companies and all of them have have had their lows as well as their highs and at one point the kickstarter the crowdfunding campaign is as a high it's another episode in their whole journey but that journey can be years if not decades in the making and that's why the reason why i just wanted to highlight these these ones and just the breadth of where talk funding is going um so this morning I got up to do a second set of interviews with um, Andy uh, from We Ask, who's a, a really great character and a, a, he's becoming a really good friend. He's based in Shenzhen in China and he has his We Ask 3-in-1 offline translation and Bluetooth of uh, earbuds um basically you can wear these earbuds right and they'll translate so in this video we can see in the video here this is this is like me being in shenzhen going how do i get to andy's office um uh, i can use put the earbud in switch on the Wu ask app and ask this uh you know young chinese woman how do i get to andy's office and it will translate into chinese and then her reply will be picked up by the phone or the earbud if she's wearing an earbud and translate it into English for me. Really great um, technology. Um, this is, for example, this is Andy's third um, crowdfunding campaign, and he's going to be joining me for his fourth one. So we, you know, that, that's where I, that's one sort of side of where I'm going. And then today, um, I just finished uh, a second interview <laughs> with um, Jeff and of Jeff and Jason and their team from uh, Killer Bad. Um, I just love like things, I guess, being real creative <laughs> types, creators who are like, really, you know, bringing like, their craft. Like this is their boyhood, childhood craft into their adult life and really referencing, for example, they're referencing in this Killer Bad series, um, people that they looked up to in the 90s who were doing really good. I'm sorry, I'm just laughing because this is a, in their video, like the, their whole thing's full of humor. <laughs> this is like a part of their intro video is a 501 uh, gene commercial. So anyway, th th that's with creatives. I just I just love meeting guys, I guess. Um, I had a really great interview with Jeff. Here's Jeff on screen at the minute. Um, both the guys, Jeff, um, is originally from Texas. Jason is from Australia, and they've they've met in this creative milieu, which is Brooklyn. And um, they are producing a series, a three part, possibly a five part series of comics called Killer Bad, and they're live on Kickstarter. And the links for Killer Bad, as well as We Ask and Andy's work in Shenzhen, will be in the video description below. And really, all I want to say, guys, is what talk funding from my heart because i just have to say i'm really wanting to help people and that's if i can maintain that ethos i really want to help people i know the entrepreneurial journey the bleep storm that you can go through at times you know and um to get a you know to get any sort of business any sort of product launched is is hard work and uh, you know I've interviewed really great people this week who will all share what i'm what i'm saying um so today i have my twitter hour at seven o'clock and i have a time of recording um four hours and what i've told andy and also uh jeff of killer bad is that i want to get their videos done um because where Killer Bad's concerned, they're getting priority because they've got five days to go and they've hit their target, but I want them to really get at least $8,000, 8, guys. So come on, guys, we can do it. And in fact, let's just change this to dollars. Like, click on the link. I mean, if you like, if you grew up like I did with um, in the age before 
computers really uh uh I, I grew up in the world of going around the, on a Saturday morning uh, to get my weekly fix of cartoons from our local news stations. So look, guys, they're at $6,359 at time of recording with five days to go. Right, we can definitely hit eight in five days, but let, let's. I think we can hit $10,000, guys. So I want you to click through, get the money out of your pockets. The pledge is really good. The pledges are you can get like the digital plus is good. Um, which if you want to just not get the hard copy, you want to just get the digital one. But there's really good ones here. There's, if you're into the art and you think there's really great examples of uh, Jason's art, like all the way through here, this is all Jason's art and Jeff's storyline. Okay, all really good samples in the Kickstarter page. This is the heroes. He, Jeff was explaining to me being thrown out of the, not thrown out, but jumping out of the plane and only two had parachutes. Like what a great way to start a story. Okay, I'm not going to give two away. And actually Jeff in the interview didn't give too much, too much away either. Um, but look, look at this, right? Like this is great stuff. And like, like for $25 guys, you get the limited edition um, Kickstarter exclusive cover which is really great. And the, the one that I would go for is the $30 horror fan one. Um, if you click through, you'll be able to see what these pledges get. Um, it's really great. And they are, and some of the items are just shipping in the US, but they are opening up now to ship anywhere in the world. So you can get the horror one anywhere in the world, shipped anywhere in the world, and also the limited edition Kickstarter exclusive shipped anywhere in the world. Um, if you love good cartoons, you know, buy into this series not cartoons, sorry, comics. Um, buy into this series now because this is the this is the this is the first one of three, um, possibly five. Um, uh, Jeff was saying he's maybe working on the script for another two or four and five. Um, really great. If you you know just look at this, you know. And again, where Andy's concerned, these are really. I've actually one of the reasons why I've got Andy back. I interviewed Andy yesterday, but we came back again because um, on the Woo Ask website, he has a lot of other products, which I've showcased just in an extra tuck funding, extra interview um, translation services, where, you know, in this case, in the Woo Ask one, it was good to have your mobile phone with the earbuds, but he also has other independently, like voice recorders, which are just the recorder itself, and they are really good. So I'm wanting to get those interviews posted today as well. And I want to get this all done at least killer bad and one key um we ask video done by seven o'clock tonight guys so i'm gonna be really focused four hours work here um it's because i'm doing my twitter hour at seven o'clock so i just so you all know i do a twitter hour every thursday seven o'clock uh, uk irish time and um, where i retweet um pre-launch and live crowdfunding campaigns to my 10k followers and i get really good engagement from doing that so that's it folks i just want to emphasize the ethos all this long story short is talk funding is all about helping helping people reach their goals going beyond their goals supporting their hard fought journey uh to getting live on Kickstarter, live on indiegogo whatever platform they're using crowdfunding platform so please like and subscribe to my youtube channel and please if you want to book an interview book an interview with me if you want to do a discovery call it's a 20 minute discovery call do that we can just sort of talk talk base see where you are at and i'm now going to be starting doing advisory calls because what i've noticed with some campaigns is they're not really ready and they're coming in and they're putting their time energy and at times money in the campaign which isn't going to work and i'd rather them pay me basically as an advisory call it's not going to cost you that much to do that to go over look at your page um there was one uh campaign i mentioned this week which had a lot of typos in it so i was able to go through and say look you've got a lot of really glaring admissions here like a mistakes here which sort of takes the shine of what uh, off your product so let go away, go away. Basically, I did, basically and politely said, go away and come back and then launch, get, get this fixed. So simple things they got um, will add knots, literally knots, hundreds, if not thousands of dollars onto your campaign. And I'm gathering testimonials to show that my work is working.
So that's enough off my soapbox. Um, see you tonight in the Twitter hour at, at seven o'clock. Okay, guys, I gotta go. I gotta get on and get these this edit this video quickly edited and the uh, other ones. Like uh, uh, killer bad one. Uh, link in the video description below. And Andy's we ask. I need to get these videos edited. Okay, lads. Okay, everybody. Bye, global citizens. Global sustainable peace. Now we need.